Hello everyone, welcome back to a new video. So, as you can tell, I'm really tired. It is... I have absolutely zero idea what day it is. It's Monday, the 27th of July. Um, yeah, <laughs> it's, it's 20 to 9, so it's like almost mid-morning, which is like not great, but yeah, let me just catch you up. So I think not last week, but the week before, I had to have a period. Um, I've briefly explained this before. Basically, I did not say those words properly, but never mind, moving on. Um, my periods are like, they're really heavy and they're really painful. Um, I do have a diagnosis of something, I can never remember what it is, it's a stupid long medical word um, and you know we're also in the process of getting like seven other things diagnosed with various different things so the point is it sucks and I hate having periods so much especially because they're entirely useless because the only thing you use them for is having children and as I've said many times before I despise children. So it really does just seem like some sort of big cosmic joke, really. So yeah, I had a whole week of, um, like, agony, no sleep, and feeling miserable. And then last week I was kind of just focused on making sure the beach trip went well, which it did in the end. I mean, it didn't go perfectly well, but it went alright. I got what I needed, basically. Um, and then I spent the latter half of last week not sleeping because like I never get any sleep while I'm on my period because um well usually it's because I'm far too uncomfortable because of uh like the pads I don't wear tampons I hate tampons um I always wore pads before but like they're so uncomfortable I hated them so much it was a huge sensory thing um so I just couldn't get to sleep and then on top of that because my periods are really heavy I'm also always worried about uh, like getting blood all over my bed. <laughs> um, I have now got uh, my period underwear which I will be doing a review video for just <laughs> not yet which helped with the sensory thing but I still got blood everywhere <laughs> so I'm like I'm not really sure like it, it's still a lose scenario really because on the one hand I was able to sleep better but on the other hand because I was more relaxed and therefore able to sleep I then therefore got more blood everywhere as opposed to not being able to sleep and that because I'm really aware of it and so therefore I don't get blood everywhere so I don't know it's like you lose either way really but basically life is shit because <laughs> I'm female so honestly anyone like w what did we do to deserve periods I mean really but anyway that is not the point basically I've just I'm really tired because I didn't get any sleep and then I've been having really weird dreams which is also like a side effect and it takes me weeks to recuperate after a period which is why I'm on the pill and so therefore I only have like three a year instead of one every month because it, it got to the point where I was constantly like either on my period or in the recovery bit from it because obviously you have your period for a week and then it took me like three weeks to recover from it, but then it's a month, so then you get your period again, so. Which is why I only have them like three times a year, which is a whole three times too many. Um, but you know. So, I'm still recovering from that, um, both in terms of, you know, my mood and my sleep and the fact that I ate everything that crossed my path and, you know, just all of those normal things. Uh, I haven't showered in about a week either. So, you know, so today is really just going to be a get my shit together kind of day because, um, well, it's almost the end of July. So obviously I'm doing the newts um, in August. And so I have 17 books to read. I, I wrote a blog post about my TBR. So if you want to go and read that, then you can. But I will be talking about my TBR in the actual newts vlog. I, I think I'll split the newts vlog into two again. So you'll have one halfway through the month 
but yeah, I've got 17 books to read, so I need to make sure I'm sort of on top of my shit by the end of the week, because that's when August starts, I believe it starts, it starts on Saturday, August is Saturday, so yeah, I've got until Friday to sort my shit out, basically. I'm also going to my grandparents on Thursday, because it's my dad's birthday on Thursday, so we're going up to see his parents, because uh, we're allowed to do that now. Um, and while we're there, I'm going to use their very lovely big house um, and huge gardens. Like, they have two gardens. They have, like, a huge back garden and a huge front garden. It's so sick. They also have one of those houses that you can run all the way around the bottom floor, <laughs> um, which I just... That's, like, peak life, really, if you can do that. And they have a conservatory, so it's, like... They got a great house, basically. So yeah, I'm just gonna use their house um, to do take some photos while I'm there because <laughs> I don't like the oh sit in the lounge and make small talk bit. So yeah, obviously I have to be in somewhat of a fit state to do that on Thursday. So I've got I've got some stuff to do before that because I've done nothing for the past fortnight. So my room is currently a tip, <laughs> which if you know me at all does not equal a very good mood because I hate mess so I need to the first thing I'm going to do is tidy the fuck up because it's so messy and then I think I'm going to do some stretching because I haven't done that in like a fortnight because I also can't do that while I'm on my period because otherwise I get blood everywhere again um which is obviously great so I need to do that. I also need to have a goddamn shower because uh, my mum very kindly washed my hair for me, uh, but I stink. So <laughs> I need to have a shower. So I'm going to do those things and then see where I'm at, basically. <laughs> five in the evening now um I, I had a shower and everything like I said and then my mum's going to Tesco so I went and sat in the back of the car and I briefly tried to do some work but my computer was all like oh you're offline so we can't download the files so I was like okay screw that so I played Animal Crossing instead <laughs> I have now done some work though um and also eaten some food and scolded my phone for a good like two hours so now I'm ready to do something <laughs> I think I do now have, if you cast your eye back, like, what, a month now or something, you'll know that I was making dresses out of trash, but I, like, I, I ran out of stuff, basically, because I needed to wait for the charity shops to be open again, or, well, more specifically, the one single charity shop that we have in the entirety of the town where I live, um, that isn't, like, all the way out and in a shitty area, um, and it's, like, it's a really small charity shop, but it's a really good one. So I needed to wait for that to be open. It was finally open <laughs> um, last week. So I went and I've got the stuff that I need now in order to finish the trash dresses. So I just need to finish them. <laughs> like I literally have like, I have like five of these packs of plastic cutlery that I got from the charity shop. I have like old lace tablecloths or whatever these were. These were old pillowcases. Um, yeah, I've got, and then I've got like bags of just paper under there, toilet roll tubes, kitchen roll tubes, milk bottle tops, like tablet blister packs, all sorts of crap. So 
Um, I'm not going to be starting any new ones today, but I think I just want to get some of... Because I started, it's going to be like a like a jellyfish dress. <laughs> it's this one here that I'm doing. So it's going to be like a big ball gown skirt and it's in panels. So I just need to sew the panels together, um, or the base layer. Um, and then I can do like the, there's going to be like a, like a sheer layer over the top, which are also in panels, but the seams are going to be on the outside so that it looks cool. <laughs> I guess. I'm tired. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna do that and honestly I'll then probably just call it a day because I'm tired. Okay, so it's Thursday now. <laughs> yeah, so it's Thursday. It's 20 past 7 in the morning. I am dressed and I've actually put makeup on. I'm even wearing jewellery today because it's my dad's birthday so we're going to see his parents um, for the day and I'm also using the opportunity to do some photo shoots because <laughs> Um, I need space and my nanny's house is huge and more specifically her gardens are huge gardens plural She has a front and a back garden and they're both huge. Yeah, so I did you haven't missed loads over the last few days I did manage to finish one of the trash dresses on Tuesday and the thing is about sewing is that it's really difficult for me to film because it takes up like my whole room there's no place to put the tripod when I'm sewing because everything's so big and it takes up so much space but also, I only have one spare plug socket under my desk, and so I have to choose. Do I plug the fairy lights in, or do I plug the sewing machine in? And obviously it has to be the sewing machine, which means I have to have the big light on, and I kind of need it on anyway so I can see what I'm doing. Um, but that means that the camera does the horrible flicky light thing, which I still can't figure out, by the way. You'd think it would be the shutter speed, and I've tried that, and I've looked online, and everyone says, just change the shutter speed, and I'm like, I'm doing that, and it doesn't work. So, I don't, I don't know what's wrong with it. <laughs> Basically, it's just it's really difficult to film so because there's not enough space and the light is weird <laughs> But yeah, I just I wanted to get that done because it had been sitting on <laughs> like on my top of my what's, What are they called? Chest of drawers for like almost two months at this point and I was sick of it So that's out the way my room is tidier than it's been in about three months, which is great um, So you know, I now have uh, four is it four? Yes, four four dresses finished and I did the peacock tail as well. Still got quite a few to go, um, but I now have pretty much all of the resources I need because the charity shop was open last week, so I've got everything I need. It's just a case of doing it now. And then yesterday I was just filming and editing a video that went up yesterday. So yeah, I've just been busy and been doing things that I can't film. So, you know, but it is now Thursday. So we're leaving at 8.30 because I want to use the conservatory to take a few photos at my nanny's house early in the morning because that's where the sun rises. And then I'll be doing my other photo shoot in the front garden in the afternoon when the sun is around the other side of the house. Um, and in the middle we'll obviously be eating food and doing presents for my dad and blah 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 So I'll film as much of it as I can and I'll see you there I guess I've been super crappy at vlogging this week um, Yeah, I actually didn't really end up filming anything at my nanny's I filmed this clip of us driving there uh, and that was it because like I got a few photos But honestly it was too windy and too hot so I didn't really do that much shooting in the end and then the rest of it was just you know sit around talk have dinner and then go home so <laughs> and also yesterday i spent the entire day playing sims so you really didn't miss anything there but it's saturday now it's actually 20 to 11. i am going out now though because i need to do some actual shooting for a collab i'm doing with my friend charlie um so yeah we're gonna go out and we're gonna do that and then we'll see because uh the readathon the newts readathon has started as of today so a lot of today will probably be reading, uh, but that's for the Newts vlog. <laughs> this is the outfit of the day, very simple, I just got a strappy crop top on and these trousers which I think I got from Asda. Um, so it's like bit kind of like a bit of a picnic bitch look basically. <laughs> okay so it is now Sunday, I am editing the vlog and realised I did not end it. <laughs> So I went out yesterday and I took the photos. That all went well, but I'm not gonna show you them yet. Although I might have used one of them in the thumbnail actually, but 
never mind. If you want to see all of them, then you'll have to check out the collab which is going up on Friday. I will leave the link to both mine and Charlie's blog down below. So if you want to see those photos, then you can check that out on Friday. But for now, that is the end of the vlog. <laughs> I wasn't sure if this vlog was even going to be anything because I feel like I've barely vlogged at all, but I think I've got enough footage to make a vlog. So <laughs> thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Like it if you did. Subscribe for more. I've got loads more videos coming up. There should be two videos a week for like at least two months now so I'm spoiling you really and yeah thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video